<laughs> so gooey. feeling we're not bikini bottom anymore. Looks more like the Wild West. Partner, I'm looking for my pal, Mr. Krabs. About yay high, red, likes money? Crab problem, eh? <laughs> I reckon you're gonna want to talk to the sheriff in Manta Fe. Phew, what a fun ride! Yeah, let's get lined and ride it again. I don't get what Cassandra wants with this stuff. The only thing I know about jelly is jelly sandwiches! Patrick, the Sandra knows what she's doing. If she says bringing her jelly will help get our friends back, then bring her jelly we shall. SpongeBob, what do you see? Water? Soda? Is soda water? What do you see? Barnacles, it's so small! We'll never fit in there! Why do we have to be so big? Oh, it's not small, Patrick. It's not? It's just very, very far away. <laughs> We're safe, Patrick! It's Mrs. Puff! If anyone knows where Mr. Krabs is, it's her! She probably doesn't know us here, even though she knows us back home. We have to get to know her first, just like we got to know her the first time she got to know us back home, you know? No. <laughs> so gooey. Look at me go! luggage doing in the middle of the desert? I think it dropped from Mrs. Puff's carriage. <laughs> Look, more loose luggage. How do we get across? I think... Ah, uh, I think he 
Several near death experiences on this ranch before. Yeah, it's the wild west for you. Whoa, is that Mrs. Puff? What's she doing on a ranch? Mm, I love ranch. Strangers, you came here by foot? That's awfully dangerous. You could dry out in a heartbeat. I get puffy just thinking about it. I get puffy after eating stale food. Hi, my name's SpongeBob, and this balloon is Patrick. We're looking for our friend, Mr. Krabs, but he might not be called Mr. Krabs. He could be traveling under a different name. Oh, like Jeremy! Or Petunia! Or Captain Claw! Or Ronaldo! A crab without a name, huh? Try Manta Fay. It's where everyone without something ends up. Could you give us a ride there? This is a riding school, not a taxi service. However, if you take my test, you could get there yourself with your own riding license. <laughs> my very own license! Whenever you're ready, meet me by the seahorse. We'll see if you can stay on it all the way to Manta Fe. <laughs> uh, Mrs. Puff, I mean, teacher lady, uh, I need to confess that uh, I've been through this sort of thing before, and uh, I'm not always the best test taker, so... Uh, so, any chance we can skip this part? Oh, nonsense, SpongeBob. <laughs> A little rodeo never hurt anyone who survived it. Ready, set, and go! No! You scored 35.7 points. Go around! Phew, that was a close one. Keep on smashing! Have six points <laughs> out of seven. <laughs> Only one point away from passing. Yay! Oh, can we repeat the test? It was so much fun. Oh no, that's not necessary. I, I didn't know you had fun. Fun is worth an extra point. <laughs> Here's your license. Thanks, partner. Oh, license. <laughs> She can. This license only allows me to ride seahorses and seahorse like animals. With the exception of. Uh, this doesn't say anything about boatmobiles. Well, 
Once boat mobiles have been invented, I'll just have to take the test again. To Manta Fay, my floating friend. My foot is killing me from all that riding you had to do. Look, it's Sandy. I mean, it's the sheriff. Now look what the snail dragged in. You may be yellow as mustard, but you got the bite. Oh, don't bite. Too unsanitary. I'm looking for my friend, Mr. Krabs. Have you seen him? He's got big, beautiful eye stalks and tiny little legs. I'm off duty for the dole, sweetie. But hey, if you can take me, I might look into your case. Yo, Ann, better get yourself a straw partner and make sure it sits straight. We're going to have ourselves a nice little cactus soda showdown. There ain't a sea critter alive. Ain't you fuller of surprises than my socks after a sandstorm? Taking on them jelly bandits like that? Let's see what you're really made of. Grab your straw. Cheers. Chug, 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 chug! Chug, 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 chug! Bottoms up! Cheers! Cheers! Ain't you fuller of surprises than- Cheers! Bottoms up! Chug, 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 chug! Chug, 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 chug! Chug, 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 chug! Bottoms up! Chug, 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 chug! Skull! Doggone it, we're out of cactus soda! Ever since this red-handed bandit bandits took over our cactus farms, we've been running low on supplies. Any chance you can go up to Captain Hills and fetch some more cactus juice for us? The sooner we can finish our duel, the sooner I can solve your crab case. Don't you worry, Sheriff. Deputy SpongeBob. And Balloon Deputy Patrick. Are on the case. I don't like cactuses. Don't worry, Patrick. We'll be out of here as soon as we find more cactus juice. Uh-oh. Looks like it wants to duel. familiar looking gentleman can point us in the right direction. Howdy, sir. I'm SpongeBob SquarePants. Have we met before? Hey, cowboy. Eh, uh, sorry, uh, you don't ring any bells. But I couldn't help but overhear you talking about entering the cactus beverage business. That demands a strong spine. I suggest hiring a consultant to guide you. For a wee share of, um, 70%, I'll tell you where to find the cacti with the most refreshing sap. Folks pay insane amounts of money for him. Since the shortage, 
Seventy percent? That sounds a bit fishy. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say seventy? I meant, um, eighty. Now we're talking. Just keep going till you reach them Cacteen Hills. And don't ye scam your hard-working consultant. I'm only taking ninety percent of the business. Come on, Patrick. Let's find those thorny cucumbers. Ooh, look! An old cat. This seems pretty dangerous. Oh, baby, that cactus is way up there, huh? Funny meeting you here. Just, uh, checking on the barrels. You know, keeping them safe from bandits. There's Juicy Prophet, I mean, uh, Cacta, all around these parts. Now get! This is it, Patrick! That Juicy Cactus Gold awaits us! Yee-haw! <laughs> Cover my buns. <laughs> so gooey.
my best friend. That should cover my buns. Looks kind of familiar. You got a knack for reaching them cacti. Just drop the juice in this here barrel for uh, <laughs> safekeeping. Trail, my little saps.
more chafing. than that, boy -o. It says, Mine closed, bullworm activity. That little wormy must. Maybe we should keep moving, Patrick. I've never seen a fish like this. Who knew the desert was such a hazardous environment? Is it just me, or is everything in this place trying to hurt us? I'm feeling better already. We melt those cactuses for all they were worth.
Patrick, I think we've fallen down some kind of large, dark, bird-shaped cavern. That means it was probably made by a ferocious, terrifying creature, like a, a goose. I can't tell if we've gone this way yet. It's so dark. Howdy, strangelings. What brings you to this whole place? We really, really need to get back to the surface, Mr. Miner, sir. Our friend Soda he... Well, I could let you use my elevator. But what's it? Anything you want. There's nothing good if you can get my tooth. If I was a tooth on the loose in the nest of a giant worm, where would I be? Speaking as a slob who lives in a hole, I think something is living in this hole! Ew, it smells like Gary's litter box in here. That smell was not me. Oh, look at the golden tooth! Oh, let's go back to the monster before something comes looking for it. With a bit of gold nugget, you'd be worm food by now. But since you survived, did you find my tooth? Do snails leave slime in the woods? Of course! Whatever you say. The elevator's all yours, boys. Oh, and I don't know what you did down there, but it left a powerful stink on you. All right, let's take that elevator. That should lift our spirits. <laughs> 46. They're stealing our soda supplies! Hurry up, Patrick! We got ourselves a train to catch! Funny coincidence, huh? Bandits steal our train and Mr. Krabs happens to be on it. <laughs> Hold on! Mr. Krabs is the red-handed bandit! We have to get closer so we can bring him home!
Sweet Davy Jones Locker SpongeBob, I know you mean well, but you gotta let me stay! Please! You're under arrest, red handed bandit! Like, like I was saying, SpongeBob, you gotta take me back! I beg you, this old soft shell won't last a day in jail! Sorry, Sheriff, I'm taking this one in. I sure should stop drinking so much cactus soda on the job. Sure taught me a valuable lesson. That it's not all about money? What? No, no, oh, no, 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 no. It's always about money. I, 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 but I did learn that I can't put a price on me employee of the month. We should ask Cassandra where else we can find our friends. That lady knows everything. It's like she has 